Uh oh. Not so fast. We need backup. I'll call oh, shoot. Oh, what's going on, everybody? Z here. Welcome back to some Elite Dangerous Odyssey. So, today we are going to pick up on solo play. Uh, I was going to do the training. I might do the training in my own time. So we're going to hop into solo play. We're going to see how things are. Hopefully you guys enjoy. If you do, like, subscribe, all the fun things. So uh, yeah, this is like the first official like getting into the game and not doing the training thing. So um, yesterday's video or the last video, we only could get into the training thing because like the servers, I think were just so bombarded with everybody trying to play. Uh, yeah, it's pretty exciting stuff. Okay. So I am in a ship. I'm in my ship. Okay. Um. How do I get out of here? <laughs> I wasn't ready for this. Uh, okay. So maximum fuel. Hold on here. What do we What do we have here? Um. Okay. So let's see what we got. I want to disembark. Yes. Okay. Cool. Disembark is to get out. Got it. <laughs> uh okay oh my gosh here's my ship here's my ship here's my ship here's my ship okay so i'm in the magnetic contact active uh here's the back of my ship oh my gosh it's amazing it's super amazing looking look at how big it is oh my gosh it's huge look at the black redness oh it's made okay so um i don't really know what's going on right now i don't want to start a new character commanders you want giving heck yes let's do this uh, let's go. Wait, where is the X? Oh, it's over on this side. Okay, that's fine. We wanted to do a quick run around of our ship. Oh, it looks so good. Look at that. Oh, we've got a second seat down there, too. You know, I didn't even know that. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Okay, so let's go see what we got because, um, jump further. Lakon. Let's go see what we got. Let's see what we got going on because uh, I think we need to gear up because I'm, I'm guessing we don't have a suit or like the suit that we do have is like super basic standard, you know. Uh, we probably don't have any like weapons or anything. Uh, go to concourse. Yes, please. Oh, thank you. Thank you. All right. Let's do this. Oh, this is so exciting. So leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think of Odyssey. What do you what are you, the people that are playing this game? What are you thinking of the game? How do you how do you like it? Are you enjoying it? Because I got to say, I'm, I'm pretty excited about this. Now, like I said, I really want to do the ground stuff. The good guys get even and earn a few credits. Step on up. If you want to help the good guys get even, step on up. Okay. So let's take a peek here. Uh, Pioneer Supplies Lounge. Okay. So let's... Why don't you use your gun to do some good? Oh, I could. I could indeed. Okay. So here we go. The market for? Come take a look. So what you after today? Uh, let me see what you got. Sure. Take a look around. Suits available zero. What? Zero suits available, zero weapons available. None of these are work. None of these work. What? Sure, you've got everything. Hmm. I'll be here if you change your mind. How does she not have any? Like, it's so weird that. But you have stuff. Huh very very weird maybe we need to go somewhere else let's try to let's try to go to a different station here so i'm about to do something i probably shouldn't do <laughs> and that's fly my own ship <laughs> so let's see where is um i need a call where's the place to call my ship at hey you any good at getting into places you aren't meant to be uh, not really, no. Yes, kind of. I don't know. Apex Interstellar Transport. Where did I come from? I came from one of these, right? Uh, oh, Aspect Explorer. Okay, cool. I don't have to call it in because it's already here. All right. So let's go hop into our ship. And I'm going to try to fly somewhere. And I want to see what's going on because I don't... Why can't... Why? I don't know why there would be no suits available. Um, You know what I mean? I don't know. And then let's see. Uh, Insight Hub. Commander. Let's see okay so there's that uh secondary weapon see i don't i don't have like anything flight suit nothing nothing like super crazy going on here 
Squadrons, Power Play, Codex, Commander. Um, Inside Hub, Navigation, Transactions, Contacts. So, nothing like super crazy. Alright, let's get... Oh my gosh, I do love that ship. That is so good looking. So good looking! Now, I'm actually kind of curious too, uh, if we can put an SRV on this thing. Which is the surface vehicle. Oh, we came out from the back, didn't we? Yeah, I'm pretty sure we came out. Yeah, we came out from the back here. Because uh, I'd like to put an SRV in here. So that way we can have a land vehicle to, to do some land stuff. Press E to board shift. Okay. Uh, pilot seat. No. Uh, board. <laughs> I thought you had to select, like, which seat. All right. So let's take a quick peek here at what we got going on. Um... Uh, let's see. F maximum fuel fully repaired, unavailable, return to surface, starport surfaces, auto launch. Okay. This is probably a really, really bad idea because I completely forgot how to fly this thing. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. It'll be fine. Um, I think you can autopilot for the most part. Pretty sure you can autopilot things for the most part. Um, yeah. Oh, geez. Engines engaged. Uh huh. Hmm. Okay. So I think I'm gonna actually have to take over command now. And I don't remember how to fly this. Hopefully it's WASD. Hey, we're rolling. Okay. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Now, um, oh darn, I used to have like my, oh, I used to have all my hotkeys like done up real nice. I need to do that because I need, let's see, navigation. All right, let's look at our, let's look at the system map here. Where are we? So we are in this Paris hub, which is crazy because I would think that that would be a main, a main station. You know what I mean? Like a super main place. Maybe it's not. Maybe this, this system isn't, like, you know, super huge. Let's look at the galaxy map. Maybe we need to fly somewhere completely different. Um, oh, I have something over here on Mitra. I have a ship over there. What does, uh, what does this place have? Allegiance is Federation, population 4.7 million, boom status for final industrial... Uh, can I look at, where is the system? View system map, okay. Oh, that's, this place is even smaller than ours. Volterra Horizons? What do I have here? I have a ship here of some sort. This looks like a smaller, uh, smaller system than what we're in right now. Okay, you know what, we're gonna go to Mitra because 4.7 million people is a lot of people. Yeah, that's a lot of people. So, let's go ahead and let's set... Let's pull up our system map here. I think, I think I'm doing this. I, I don't know, I could be doing this wrong. Uh, Voltaire Horizons, it should be a... Uh, Falcon's Nest Federation Confederacy Influence. Let's go here. Hold the plot route, okay. Rot plowed it, rot, rot plowed it. Can you even believe that? <laughs> All right, so now, all I should have to do, like I said, so you can fly as much as you want, because as you can see, like I'm flying, twist and turn and all that fun stuff. Like we're doing, we're doing whatever we want. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and free cam this. We're going to go over here. We're going to go to navigation. Uh, actually, I'm just going to hit one to open my navigation panel a little bit bigger. And so I want to go to, so Mitra, I need to go there. However, Oh, can I actually just go straight there? Nearby star system, check out the galaxy, engage hyperdrive. Frame shift drive charging. Okay. So sometimes you have to jump from place to place to place. Um, but this is gonna jump us there and kind of like super cruise us, I think. I hope. No, that did not, engage. that didn't super cruise me. Okay, we gotta go this way. Mitra, right there. Four, three, 
All right, here we go. <laughs> We're gonna go see if we can buy some stuff. Uh, now, can I super cruise assist this? Uh, jump into my truck. Okay, we can't do anything while we're jumping. We're gonna come out really close to a sun. Watch. It always happens. Yep. I feel like that's way too close. Alright, so now I'm gonna pull up my navigation. And I wanna put... We are going to... Mitra 3B. Is that where we set our destination to? No, Volterra Horizons right here. So I'm going to grab this. Um, Super Cruise Assist. We're going to go ahead and engage that. And it is going to automatically... Well, for the most part, allow me to... Once I align myself with the, the correct thing. It's going to automatically pull me in there, which is super nice. Now, you got to be careful. The reason for this is because when you buy a new ship and you upgrade a ship, I'll kind of show you here in a little bit from what I remember, is you actually can get rid of the super cruise assist and the landing assist and the takeoff assist. You can get rid of those, which you don't have to have them. A lot of people don't like to use them because they take up slots in the, the ship slots or whatever. However, for somebody like me, I'm not that great flying ships, you know? Like, I, I don't think I would ever be a pilot, but hey! <laughs> You know, I, it is what it is. So I use all of the assisted stuff to help me get from point A to point B. Now, like I said, I think this should put us to where I need to go. And then I think we can auto land, if I'm not mistaken. And uh, Volterra Horizons. All right, so now we Wait, need... God. Right. Uh, we got to contact them. So request docking. Permission denied, Commander. Decrease range and submit again. Decrease range. Oh, we're done. We're too far away. All right, let's get a little bit closer here. Uh, I think you have to be within. I can't remember how close you have to be. There's like a distance. I think it's like six and a half kilometers so like i think 6.5 we're good so let's go back in here uh request docking there we go Your assigned landing pad is number zero five. awesome and we're auto docking ship scan detected that's okay i don't think i oh I don't think I have anything, but I don't know what I was hauling before. No idea. No idea. Okay, we're going to come in here. Um, So, I th I would say 90% of the time, this auto stuff works fine. But there is a chance of it not working okay. <laughs> From what I recall. Uh, so, every hopefully everything's okay. But yeah, this is going to auto land for us. Then we're going to hop out. We're going to go check out this place. And hopefully we can buy some gear. I want some gear. I also don't know where the starting area is because, like Landing I said, we're not starting. Like, I've, I've already played this a little bit, so. I want to disembark, but we got to wait till we're inside. So we're going to go ahead and disembark. And that's going to take us inside. And then we can go check out everything. We can go check out all the shops and stuff. And then maybe, hopefully, get some missions going. All right, hangar lobby. Heck yes, no fire zone. Haul more with lake on. I love the ads and everything. It's so cool. So let's go see what we can get. Now I don't. I'm kind of curious about the um, like how much money can be made with on foot missions. Uh, yeah, let's go here because when I was haul I was hauling cargo, and that's how I've made like all of my money is just hauling cargo from like you know a satellite station to a planet side station. So I'm curious, Frontline Solution, Intra Astra, Vista Geonemics. <laughs> uh, okay, let's see if I can buy stuff here. All right, so Inter Astra, what are you? Oh, this is the place to buy ships. Oh, let's talk to you. Can we talk to you? Welcome to Inter Astra. Take your time. Whatever you need, we've got the ship for uh, I'm interested in your services. Take your time. Purchase ships, uh, manage your ships. Oh, what ships do I own? I ASP Explorer, 
an adder, sidewinder, type 6 transporter. Um, pretty sure you start off with this one. And then I think I got this one, and then this one, and then this one. So, um, okay, let's go back. Let's see what else. Let's see what ships we can buy. Purchase ships. So, we got the Sidewinder, the Eagle. Hauler, the Adder, Viper, Cobra. The Cobras are pretty cool. I do like the Cobra Mark III's. Um, Type 9 Heavy. Uh, Imperial Eager. This vendor does not currently stock this ship unavailable. Oh, we can still see what it <gasps> Ooh! See, that right there, that looks like a good, um, like, back and forth, like, mercenary kind of style ship. You know what I mean? I feel like that's what we need. I feel like we need a good, like, merc ship, you know? Like, if we're going to go down and be doing surface missions, we don't need something big. We need something small that we can get in, we can get out. Oh, the Imperial Courier. Ho, 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 ho. Okay, hold on. That thing looks, mmm. That thing does look pretty good. How's this Vulture look? Vulture looks pretty cool. This federal dropship, 14 million. <laughs> these are huge ships, though, I believe. I believe these are, like, gigantic ones. Oh, Imperial Clipper. Two, 22 million credits. Oh, that's pretty. That looks too fancy. That almost looks too fancy for, like, a mercenary ship, you know? Uh, a Fertilance. Oh, this thing is huge. Gigantic. The Mamba. Gigantic. Okay. Um, so, man, I'm actually kind of curious about this little, this, uh, well, the Imperial Courier. Fighter Bay, incompatible, multi curl incompatible, landing pad, small. Imperial Eagle. I think, I just think that one looks cool, you know? Small landing pad. High speed attack ship. I don't know. Okay. Let's get out of here. We're, we're drooling over ships. <laughs> uh, but different stations have different ships. So um, if you if you didn't find something you wanted, uh, you can go to different stations to find different ships. Now, I'm sure there's an online community that says, hey, what ships are where. But do you have stuff? Let me browse your stock. Sure, take a look around. Oh, good. Okay. So we do have suits available. The Maverick. Or the Artemis. Oh, the Artemis looks super fancy. I kind of like the look of this one, though. Armor resistance percentage. Okay, so I'm guessing that's ballistic. Mm, I don't know what that is. Laser. Explosive. So this one has slightly higher ballistic and whatever the cutty deal is, but less laser damage. Um, consumable slots. So... Two grenades, one electrical grenade, one shield grenade. Different types of grenades, I'm sure. Uh, one health pack, two energy charges, and two uh, electronic edelias. Hmm. I feel like the Maverick is a good all-around suit, you know? Of course, this one does look pretty cool, too. And then there's also modification slots. A genetic sampler. Oh! This almost looks like a um, perfect for extended field trips in remote areas. The Artemis suit offers uh, greater energy efficiency in exchange for reduced shield health. It also comes with a genetic sampler for cataloging organic discoveries. This is an explorer. This is more of a all-rounder. Hmm. Like, I like the idea of the Artemis suit, but like, I also want the, the scrappiness of this suit, you know? Oh gosh, what do we do? I don't know, we could buy both. I mean, we could buy both. We have 3 million credits right now. <laughs> I'm gonna go with the Maverick suit, just because the Maverick suit is designed for those who prefer to keep their options open. Yeah, we're gonna go with that one. Buy suit, confirm. Planning on some salvage work, are we? Uh, possibly. Don't cut yourself with the arc cutter while you're filling up all that extra carrying space. Oh, and now, don't forget to equip that suit into a loadout. Uh, okay, so now we can also purchase weapons. So let's see what we got for weapons. So, oh, we got these three. Uh, damage type laser, firing mode automatic. These are all laser type. Uh, fire mode is burst. Uh, well, let's get it. Uh, you know, 
I I really prefer I I think I prefer the ballistics. I think I prefer the ballistic style. Um, yeah, you know what? Let's just get it. My weapon. Confirm. We gotta get we gotta get ready, yeah, you know. If you're up against shielded targets, that Aphelion will slice right through them. Nice. The Eclipse is a smart choice. They go buying all of them. Good decision. <laughs> Those pistols punch through shields like no other. All right. And then so we got weapons upgrade slash sell suits. What can we do for upgrades? So Maverick upgrade available 600,000 credits suit schematic health monitor power regulator manufacturing instructions carbon fiber plating graphene. Oh, that's what it requires. And I don't have those. Okay, so we have to collect things as we go. Okay, so can we customize? Oh, we've got to make it black and red. You know we've got to. Left decal, right decal, general. Suit. Can I make it different color? What? Oh, you can buy like... You can buy different... Uh... Oh, what is this? That thing is sick! Uh, I want to see what it looks like. Wait, no, cancel. I want to see what it looks like. Like, what's what's this whole what's this whole thing look like? So, like, that's showing me those, but it's not showing me any of this. I think I like just the black and red aspect of it. <laughs> it's kind of cool. Okay, so I kind of figured what's going on here. So, uh, the reason I can only see the suit part was because I had the suits selected, or the helmet, or the torso, or the legs. Uh, so if I go back to this and I click on this, you can only see like that part. I think I like this. Uh, I think I like this Maverick Saboteur pack because it's got a lot of black and red. Um, I kind of liked this one, but this one kind of looked a little uh, a little funky for me. So if I go to the helmets and show you this, I don't know. The helmets on this are just kind of. Uh, I don't know. They're all, they're almost like they're all they're very Fallout 4 esque. And I just don't know if I like that in my space game. You know what I mean? So I think I like the Saboteur. Because it kind of keeps things, uh, you know, black and red theme, and yeah, I like that. I kind of like the, um, I kind of like this guy's too, but I liked the armor. But the armor is not the right color, you know. Like I liked the, I liked the fact that he has like all this armor plating and stuff like that, but it just wasn't the right color, you know. Oh whoa, hmm, that might be a little too much, you know. Hmm, that's kind of cool too, though. No, I think I like the saboteur. I think we're gonna go. I think we're gonna go black and red saboteur. All right. So. Oh wait. Okay. Yeah. Maverick saboteur. Uh, burgundy. Okay. Looking good. And then I can go through the helmet, and we can do all the helmets and stuff like that. So. Uh, where's the. Burgundy. So we'll put that helmet on. No, that's Maverick. No, that's sand. I don't want sand. I want burgundy. There we go. All right. And then torso. What do we have for torso options here? Ooh, look at that carbon fiber like chest plate thing. Oh, I like that. I wish there was kind of a way just to like to do the entire suit, you know? All right. So we got all of the gear uh, armaments on here. Can we can we rotate our guy? No. Okay. And then we got some decals. So can we do some decals on here? Oh, well, we can indeed oh wait hold on artemis exobiologist suit directionalist what is this oh it's kind of like those i kind of like these okay i think we're good yeah oh maverick suit oh that suit looks sick oh it looks so good it looks so good i love it okay uh so back back okay all right uh let's see what kind of consumables we can get too. med kit i have none energy cell capacity 100 100 100 100 let's see buy a med kit anyone without at least a couple of those is asking for trouble energy cell the last thing you want to do is have your soup shield disruptor taking down someone's shield frag grenade well, you're gonna give someone a really bad day shield with that projector. Thing. They aren't packed. Good choice. Sometimes uh, e breach unavailable here. Can I buy more of these? Always pays to keep a few of these on hand. Okay. All right. So we're gonna keep you those. Got everything. 
Come back anytime. We are good to go. Now, we have to change our loadout, I believe. Commander. Um, we have to change our loadout. So let's see if we, let's see if I can figure this part out. I'm trying to figure out how to make a loadout. I don't really see. Maybe we have to talk. Let's interact with this thing. Mission board third. And ta -ta. Oh, and a loadout right here. Okay. There we go. Uh, default loadout. Create. Uh, Maverick suit. Primary. That guy. Secondary. Hmm. Custodio. Uh, customized suit is already good. Equipping this loadout will clear up backpack contents. Save loadout. Uh, loadout one. I'm just gonna put this main. Okay. Uh, equip loadout. Equipping this loadout will Welcome clear backpack contents. Huh. So where would I be? Where would I put backpack contents then? So like in my main. That's the default. How do how do I have my backpack contents? Because I don't have. Uh, oh wait, hold on. Vehicle extras. What's this? Oh, it's just different colors for different things. Oh, these are all like the skins and stuff. Oh, sick. Oh my gosh. The Imperial Clipper. <laughs> Black and red, of course. There's our ASP Explorer Crossfire Red. No, we got so I bought the uh I bought the striped edition. Oh my gosh, I love these. Love all of these. Okay. Um, I'm trying to figure out Hollow Me. What's Hollow Me? I'm trying to figure out my Oh, this is just like my body. Okay. Except without saving. Okay. I was trying to figure out the backpack contents thing. I'm not sure, really sure what's going on with that. So let's go in here. What is this place? Can I be of assistance? What kind of genetics place oh, is this? A fellow inquisitive mind, I see. I'd like to sell my organic data. We always seek to learn more about life. The organic the data detected. Click. Gather organic data by using the genetic sampler to catalog organic matter. Oh. Can I help you with anything else? Please do return when you have some organic. That's so finished. cool. So you can use the other suit to use the genetic gather. Okay. All right. All right. This is just too cool. Um, okay, so I want to equip my other suit, but it says I can clear my backpack contents, but I can't see my backpack contents because it says unavailable in port. So I don't know. Maybe I need to go. Let's go to my ship because I just bought all those grenades and stuff. And I don't know what's in my backpack. Okay, so let's board our ship here and let's see if maybe we can see it now. No. No, we definitely cannot see anything now. Uh, starport services. Let's see what we got here. Mission board, shipyard, commodities market, local news, outfitting, livery, advanced maintenance. Actually, let's look at the outfitting real quick. Ship loadout, modules, pulse laser, small. No, I don't want hard points. I want vehicle bays. No planetary vehicle hangers. Purchase a planetary vehicle hanger to fit an SRV bay. No fighting hanger. Fighting hanger cannot be fitted to the ship. So we need to purchase a planetary vehicle hanger in order to fit an SRV. But then we can get an SRV, which is the vehicle that we can use on the ground. Uh, so let's go back. Let's actually look. Shop. Can we buy a vehicle bay? SRV bay. How much is this? Oh, it's just that we can just get a scarab. Oh, zero slots compatible. Hmm. Zero slots compatible, zero slots available. Which is weird because it looks like it, it is capable. No planetary vehicle hangar. Purchase a planetary vehicle hangar to fit in SRV bay. Planetary vehicle hangars. Oh, right here. Planetary vehicle hangar. Seven slots compatible, seven not available. Two slots compatible. Uh, module designed to house ground based vehicles. Okay. So, 
let's say we wanted the scarab. What do I need for a scarab? Uh, data link scanner, SRV, dual repeater, vehicle bay for the planetary vehicle hangar contains a scarab SRV and all equipment needed to house to maintain it. Huh. But I can't do this one. All right, well, we're going to swap suits and then we're going to go run a mission. We're going to go with boots on the ground here. All right, we're going to go ahead. We're going to swap to this uh, equip loadout. So we have our Maverick suit. Uh, so we've got our weaponry and stuff back. Fantastic. And then let's look for a mission board here. So I want something on the ground. So we've got, uh, let's see, all combat, transportation, procurement, operation, salvage. I like procurement. Basically, you know, snatch a grab. Go grab something from this place, you know? Uh, and then let's see what we got for this. Team mission, high threat, reputation, influence. Okay, uh, theft, obtain the weapon schematic from a settlement. Nonviolent theft. Take the ship schematic from a settlement. So now I'm actually kind of curious too, because this is Destination Mitra 3B. Could we pull all of these missions for the same ones? Like... Like, it would be ideal to pull this one and this one, right? And to see if we could do both of them at the same time. Because then that would give us, like, 400,000 credits, you know? But we're kind of more worried about... Uh, well, we are worried about money and the fact that the ships are super expensive. And it actually looks like the money here is not too bad, either. Download patrol rounds from a data port on LHS 70, 17 light years away. These are only 17 lights. Like these are these are much closer. So let's do uh let's pull this mission. Uh accept mission. Um mission performance will find failing. Okay, let's accept that one. And then let's see if we can accept the other one too. Illegal mission, of course they are. Alright, so I pulled those two missions. Let's go ahead and let's exit out of here. Um Alright, let's exit out of here. Now Oh, look at their, our suit. Oh, it looks super cool. Now, we could pull a shuttle to go there, or we could fly our own ship. Um, do I want to fly, or should we just pull Should we just pull the local? Let's just, yeah, let's just use the shuttle. Why not? Let's let's try out the new, the new stuff here. Welcome to Apex Interstellar. Uh, I want to book a local shuttle. Let's see how well these shuttles are working now. Okay, so we've got a... Is this Mitra 3 Re? Yes. Okay, so that's where our missions are. Select a drop-off point. So, this is the problem, is we do have two drop-off Oh, shoot. I could take my own ship and fly from one to the other. Hmm. Yeah, we're going to take my own ship. Ooh. I don't know if this ship's going to be able to land. Yeah, it should be able to. This is kind of a big ship. I just, I just realized that. This is kind of a big boy. <laughs> All right, let's try this. Let's do it. Okay, everything looks good. Let's go ahead and auto launch. Let's make this happen. And we are out. Okay. Let's go ahead and speed up here. And uh, let's, oh, speeding. There's a speeding thing? Are you kidding me? That's hilarious. Oh, cause we're mass locked right now. Okay, so now we're probably good. Yeah. So that was uh, for mass lock stuff. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's see where we're going here. So we are going to Mitra. Let's go ahead and pull up the system map here. Now we're not far from it. We're going to Mitra. Let's set your active missions description. Da, 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 da. All right, targeting that. Current system, Mitra, Mitra, 3B, fantastic. And then let's go ahead and Mitra, 3A, Mitra, 3B. Okay, so let's click on this. Can we lock in Super Cruise? Frame shift drive charging. There we go. Let's go and pull one out of here. Four, three, oh, two, okay, we're going. One, nice. Engage. Didn't have to line up or anything, apparently. Uh, I'm going to have to line up now. Uh, yeah, something's not quite right here. Because that's where I need to go. Why are we not super cruising? <laughs> uh, super cruise assist and orbit. 
Okay, good. I was like, why is Super Chris not on? <laughs> Super Chris assist active, fantastic. So this is automatically gonna get me into orbit above uh, above the planet. And then we are going to do the landing parts of it. I think, I don't know. We're gonna find out here. I would love for these missions to be on the light side of the planet instead of the dark side, because it seems like every time I, would, I do one of these missions, it's always on the dark side of the planet, you know? Like, I wanna be out in the daytime. Yeah, are we going even, are we even going to the right place here? Mitra 3B. Oh yeah, because those are on Mitra 3B, okay. And those are my, uh, my, my quests. I was like, what's going on? Yeah, no, we're good. So it does look like our, uh, our first stop is on the dark side of the moon or dark side of the planet. Darn it. <laughs> well, I think this is a moon actually. I don't know. And it looks like our second stop is probably gonna be on the dark side as well. Fantastic. So this is going to take us into orbit, and then from here, oh goodness, I'm trying to remember. I think I have to, I think I have to do this part manually. Orbiting destination. Okay. Now I think there's also a night vision mode that we could put on here. So we're going to the Vinette chemical workshop. Um, I don't think that we can do like an automatic landing on this place. I don't know. Deactivate super cruise assist surface map bookmark this location pilots handbook pilots handbook. Okay. Mm -hmm. So yeah. So we are going to have to uh, do this one all manually, and it's been a long time since I've done this. So I am super excited about doing this. Okay. The net chemical works workshop is right there. Um. <laughs> I need to know what my night vision is. Because without night vision, it's going to be impossible to see everything. Okay, so there's our workshop right there. Let's go ahead and let's line this bad boy up. Uh, we need to do this. We need to roll over. I'm going to try to slow down. I can't see anything. Okay, so we are coasting. Coasting quickly. I feel like we should be slowing down to like the blue area. Glide complete. All right. Super sketch, I don't have my night vision on. Are we going backwards? We are literally going backwards. I'm gonna have to adjust my uh, my inputs here because I don't like my inputs. They're messing with me. This is gonna take forever. What's our elevation right now? Surface, 5,000 kilometers. Okay, so this is the place we're going. Uh, where's our systems at? Uh, modules, fire grips, inventory, storage. Where is our systems? Crew. Action navigation, info, modules, fire group, ship, functions, external light, night vision. Turn that on. Oh, there we go. Perfect. Okay, so now we can actually see what the heck is going on here. Gosh, this is so much nicer. <laughs> the night vision helps so much. <laughs> it helps so much. Okay, so we're going to get over here. A oh, couple minutes. We'll be there. No time at all. It's fantastic. All right, there we go. Docking quest docking. Request denied. What? Docking request denied. Uh. Okay. It's because there's another ship in the way. Let's go ahead and slow down a lot, apparently. Docking request denied. Oh my gosh, I can't believe there's another ship in the way. What the heck? Can I hover? Wow, I can literally just sit here and hover. Nice. So apparently this doesn't work on, uh, you know, aircraft. Well, I guess we're on a moon, huh? Maybe there's no atmosphere. Still no gravity and stuff. Anyways. Hey, okay. So can we, can we request docking now? Docking request denied. Oh my gosh. Docking request granted. Oh, we got it. Okay. Slow down for auto dock. Okay. <laughs> I was like, oh no, my ship's too big. So you can have your ship be too big. So those bigger ships, like they, they, they're, 
obviously big ships, so some of these smaller places on the ground you can't go to. Um, and I was kind of worried about that because I was like, this feels like a big ship, but it's really not. So, whew, okay. Mission updated. Nonviolent theft. Take the ship schematic Dolphin from a settlement. Successful. Engines disengaged. Refuel, refuel, restock. Uh, let's go and do a refuel. And we'll disembark once we're down. All right. So let's go check this place out, shall we? Unsafe temperatures. Yep, I am aware. All right. Uh, do not criminally inc do not criminally injure settlement personnel. Objective: Take one item from industrial locker one in the industrial production. Okay. Of course, we're on the dark side. You know, like I want to be on the light side for once. I want to see everything lit up at night. Oh, it'd be so much fun. Take the item from industrial locker one in the industrial production. Okay, so that's command center. Industrial production, that one right there, IND. Stay there, Commander. You gonna scan me? Let me scan you real quick. You know how it is. Scan detected. Go for it. I don't think I have Zero anything. Warnings. We're done here. Ooh, no bounties detected. <laughs> This is cool. Oh my gosh. Actually being able to land a ship and get out and then like do stuff. Um, let's see. That's security level one. I mean, I can go in there. Let's go this way. Suit recharge slot. I don't need that. At 96% looking solid. Is there a door up here to get in? Okay, so we just need to get in there. Anybody over here? Nope. in this panel <sighs> so I'm probably going to cut my way in so do I have my cutter and everything I have that scan mode cutting tool okay let's put that away okay so it looks like this one this airlock right here is probably going to be a no go as well because like this one's like right out in front of everybody Trying to think if there's another way to get in there. But I think we're going to have to cut that panel, overload it, like we did uh, in this tutorial, which is super cool. I'm glad that they showed us that because I'd be like, I have no idea how to get in there. Um, and I don't think there's any way up top. Hey, is this all the industrial district? Oh, it is. Let's see if there's another way. Maybe there's something else back here. Less prying eyes, you know? Oh, we could kill the power. Access panel. Hmm. So there's like multiple ways to do this, huh? It's actually really, really kind of cool. <laughs> I don't think there's any ways in over here. I don't think there's any way in right here either. No, no way in right there. Uh, I think we're going to have to go through uh, that side. That side door. And hope that nobody sees us going through there. Just a minute, Commander. You scan me? Pilot bed types are usually busy. Scan Always legal detected. work, right? The results are clear. Keep it that way. Thanks. They have no idea. They have no idea whatsoever. Okay, let's do this. Oh my gosh, this is so sketchy because we're actually doing it like in the actual game. Uh-oh. She's coming over here. She's coming over there. Shoot. And the panel's cut open. Oh no! The panel's cut open! <laughs> Maybe they won't notice something like that. Charge port. Uh, transfer. What is it? R. Overload. Overload in progress. Overload complete. Okay. Looking good. 
Entering pressurized environment. All right, take item from industrial locker one in industrial production. Okay, where's locker, industrial locker one? Oh, don't tell me it's back there. Okay, industrial locker one? Is there a terminal that I can access to figure out where? Oh, locker. Locker two? Oh, terminal, terminal. Okay, let's see if we can do this. Uh, interact. Okay, so let's see here. We're looking for facility. Uh, man center. Corridor operation. Corridor. Suit recharge socket. No, it's not one of those. Habitat. Industrial. Oh, industrial production. Uh, loading lab processing. Way corridor. Maybe we're not gonna be able to do that. Power center, building exterior. Select a room or place. Uh, can't go there though. Darn it. We don't have an e breach or the e hack thing. I mean, I guess we could scan somebody. I wonder if we can scan somebody and take up, take their information. Is this our scanner? Profile analyzer. Should we try to scan somebody? Bounty detected. Uh, can I apply that to me? Profile cloning mode. Security profile cloned. Perfect. Okay, so we got, uh... Security level one. So now facility, industrial production one, loading bay. Okay, so we are looking for industrial locker one. Requires authorization two in order to get there. Okay, so we're gonna need to find an authorization two person. Uh, but that is located. Do we do we tag it? Yeah, it's right there. Okay, cool. Oh my gosh, this is so this is so much fun. Uh, we probably should charge up our suit a little bit. Um. Is this a charge port? Yeah. Okay. Let's charge ourselves up here. Oh, that's not a suit charging port. I need a suit charging port. Is there a suit charging port down here? What are you doing? Hello. Oh, there's our locker right there. Okay, I'm, I'm trying to find a suit charging port real quick. Uh, we might need to pop back outside in order to snag one of those. Let's pop back outside to snag one. Leaving pressurized environment. There was one, I think, on this side, wasn't there? Hold on, Commander. This won't take long. Okay, Just a scan quick scan. Me. Scan detected. Uh oh. Not so fast. We need backup. I'll call oh, shoot. The alarm. Oh, no. I forgot I had the wrong profile. Okay, well, everything's going terrible now. We need reinforcements dispatched immediately. I didn't want to do this. I didn't want to do this. I didn't want to do this. This shit failed. Oh no. That's right, I had to do this without hurting anybody. Oh no, I failed everything. Okay, we gotta get out of here. I'm dead. I'm dead. That was a mistake. Oh, of course I walked outside to charge up my stupid suit. You know what? I probably had an energy cell that I could have used. Oh my goodness. <laughs> that was so much fun. That was fun. Like, you know, uh, critically injured. Yeah, you've lost consciousness. I know. I'm, I'm aware. Thank you. Uh, incident report 20 May.
3307. Mm. No cargo losses. Failed missions. Okay, continue. Maverick suit. Deploy on foot. Okay, redeploy. Confirm to redeploy. Oh, man. You know, it almost, like, oh, that was so much fun. Because, like, there was an element of, like, a snick a snicky to it. You know what I mean? Like, we had to be super sneaky about it. So, oh, super exciting. Magnetic contact active. Yeah, super exciting. But that is going to end this episode. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, like, subscribe, all the fun things. Next episode, hopefully we can successfully do a mission. Um, a lot of this episode was, you know, getting things figured out, getting uh, items equipped, getting suits equipped, all that fun stuff. Because, like, um, Commander, let's see. Yeah, I have a primary. We have a secondary. Everything is intact. So, oh, this is a lot of fun, though. Lots of fun. It is really exciting. So, uh, yes, thank you so much for coming out. Have a wonderful rest of your day. And I will see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.